drowsy person like that's the baby. It comes out the egg looking like this. Yeah, drowsy is the baby. Because all Pokemon come from I, of course... Yeah. Oh my god, the battery's dying. Whatever. Um, I, of course... When it is time for me to actually sit down and wear earrings and be fancy, I'm having earring problems. Um, oh my God, I have I'm wearing I'm wearing acrylics right now, and uh, I just I'm just having a time. I'm having a weird day. I'm actually, about to take off this suit jacket coat thing um, because I'm hot. But, um, I, let's do my makeup to film one of my last cut videos. This is the big video. Obviously, I think other things will happen. I will cover other things. But, as of right now, this is my grand opus. The biggest video I think I've, uh, ever produced, like, as a one video. Because I've produced other things. And I was like, oh, I need to break this up. And I would say, you know, the Click series as a whole is a really big project. But this is the biggest single thing. I'm wearing my nameplate necklace as of right now. I'm going to change probably. Uh, my vintage seashell earrings. Um, my pearl second holes. Um, and then this hole wasn't open, so I had to put this in. Uh, this is from, this is from Aerie and Leather pearl um i um <laughs> so i was supposed to film this video like two weeks ago and was like oh my god that's my other i'm gonna i ordered two things and so i covered the your golden palette before now i'm coming back to cover forever floral um so i have to take this jacket off to do the swatches anyway and it's hot as a motherfucker but um that's what we're gonna do today. Whew. Oh my god, I I am just trying my best. I'm gonna draw eyebrows on and then I'll swatch. I've had this product for about a year now, so I wonder if it means it's going to die on me. Um, um, <sighs> and the like four weeks since I sat down to film. I built a shelf. I've moved my bookshelf. Um, okay. Oh my god. So, um, I wonder if that means that it's about time for me to replace that. Um, I have a new bookshelf. That's what I was saying. I also have a new mirror on my desk. I have my old mirror because that one still got the zoom in, the, the like zoom in features. But I, I wanted this. <laughs> Um, and I work hard, so, um, I got it. Um, do you want to hear the story about my nails? Because the longer I sit with the nails, it's been a week, it kind of feels like I'm complaining just to complain. But, like, I paid $60, $66 for these, and, um, like, <laughs> we had to go to this, we had to go to this place, and it was... kind of sketch and it wasn't very uh the guy doing my nails wasn't very personable um he took a call during my nail appointment <laughs> um he uh had a it's kind of I've had them for a while they're bubbles and like things embedded in my nails my whole thumb was covered in nail glue and acrylic when I got out um, these uh, the, uh, um, I'm gonna supplement this because I actually have to look good today um, 
because I think I kind of have an idea of what's tea. Um, I like put in my request, that's pretty, um, when I made the appointment that I wanted to sit next to my friend and they put us on two separate sides of the, uh, of the, whatchamacallit, of the salon. Um, and that's a really pretty posy color. Um, and it just like generally was not the tea. And like, there was no way, like I knew that gel polish costs extra, that part's not gonna be like, oh my God, they didn't tell me. But there was no way for me to tell which polishes were um, gel and which ones weren't. And so I had to pay extra. Just like, when I say it out loud, and like my nails, it's, they're, they're lived in, so they look a little better. Because when I first got them, like, you could understand why I was upset. And also my hands hurt real bad afterwards. Um, and I'm like a hypochondriac baby doll. So I was like, oh great, my fingers are going to fall off. All because I, <laughs> I wanted to play around with some nails for this, for this big video. Um, I, um, I just, I haven't really done a lot of anything. I've just been, you know, surviving, I think. Um, I gotta turn the rice cooker on in a little bit. That's the thing. It's like, I'm like an adult person now. And I've always, like, as far as my time on, on YouTube, I've always been an adult person to you. But, like, like, if you follow me on Instagram for a while, I was baby. So now I'm like an adult person. I have to take care of other adult people. And that's weird. And like, ugh, this has just been such a weird little. Like, I've been worried about this and then doing other things to fill in that blank and I'm like oh, I'm gonna work on this first and then I'm gonna work on this and I just like couldn't um we've actually had a lot of growth on the channel we have 220 of you right now we might have more by the time this video goes up um and to those who appear in that time welcome and I appreciate you so much um uh, I'm pulling from the big poppy So I kind of know what I want to do. I can like pack on a darker color. Yeah. Oh, she's gone. I can turn on the rice cooker. Ah! The rice cooker was already on course um the fun thing about having a second youtube channel is that and like i would say that that's like part of my brand is i always like to show up and look like i love i love the way the other girlies do it with their with their very neutral cut crease in there they're like oh so soft, so subtle, like, look about them, I'm not subtle, I'm not soft, I'm gonna have a good time, it slightly looks like a bruise, and also, like, I don't have enough of the base colors through here,
I don't want to put too much in there. It's becoming a very complex shade of brown. Definitely looks like I got into a fist fight. Um, whatever, that's not my business. Cause I, it does it look kind of like a concerning bruise? Yeah, a little bit. Is it also like a really pretty concerning bruise? Yeah. Get wrecked, noob. Um, it's like it's not sticking right here. I am. I always look at my makeup when I'm editing videos, kind of to get a grasp on what. I do and don't like. I'm trying to figure out which. I'm hoping it translates for you because it looks really good in the mirror. Um, taking a little bit just to kind of figure out the shape showing up in like just like an unnecessarily beat matching the item that I'm gonna cover um, like because I came into I a grew up with someone who didn't wear makeup and B um, came into the makeup space and like makeup awareness in like 2016 2017 I um, I just like didn't have the context that people don't match their eye makeup to their outfit all the time like I'm doing a lot when I'm just doing the bare minimum it was absolutely insane to me it's truly lost I just like the way these shades of pink and orange look together it has the possibility of looking kind of muddy, um, but that's just not gonna be, that's just not gonna be my problem. Um, Making sure it's not the left and snatch.
portion of them, at least 30%, came in with some type <sighs> Um, my feelings about the palette. I like it. Uh, oh, it's like usable. I'm like learning how to use shimmers. I'm gonna get there. We're gonna learn together. Am I still at my glitter era? Honestly, looking at it, yes. I think I could, I think I might add some of the star sparkles. Star sparkles. Star sparkles are fun. But, like, I kind of want to keep it nice and warm toned, so nothing too crazy.
and the shock emitter continually shocks them because of these blue fires, how do you think they're going to be out of the room and selling them higher? Do you think they're out of the room and selling them higher? Do you think they're out of the room and selling them One such form is called the RedBoost.net, which builds itself on a site where you can find tons of great news, maintenance tools, and participate in discussions. And sometimes these sites do get shut down, and then people just find another form to go and get news about it. I feel like it would even be safe to assume these leaks are only happen on any form related to music or to a specific artist. It even happens in the forums of artists and in pages. I found a thread on the site in January trying to coordinate a group by Ariana Grande's unreleased song My Way. My Way was supposedly intended for sweetener, but was scrapped. The goal was to raise $5,000 to buy it, but the poster was hoping to sell it below its price. Those who know she's come here from back in 2018, they have Frank appear to post about new music. After it was clear this was not Frank, the poster he was thought to be clear about, claimed him access to other new Frank, and he now did this post. Based on perusing through Reddit threads, it seems like Spear Dark is an own maker, and his link can work with other artists who talk to our fans too. And it does seem there's two zoologies rumors about Spear Dark. In 2019, a 23-year-old hacker named Adrian Kwiatkowski was arrested by the London police. At the time of his arrest, it was estimated he made over $147,000 from stealing unreleased music from artists including x Swing, Kanye West, Little Easy, and Frank Ocean. which I did mention earlier, is one of the anomalies because that is one that a lot of people brought up. Another one that people brought up was Jalen. Okay, um, time to do the scary part. I, I hate goodbyes. I truly do. So being done with this project after, um, a year and a half is crazy, but as is life, baby, uh, you can check that out. It will be up by the time this video is up. You can check it out on my second channel, Meglina. Um, you can follow me on Instagram, Twitter, TikTok, Threads. Uh, Megan underscore Megan underscore blush underscore. You know, I'll be around. I'll be on the block. I'll be tweeting. I'll be talking. I'll be posting stories on uh on my on my stories on TikTok. I be having a time so yeah okay <laughs> it's time now all right um I'm having <laughs> all right cool um, I just yeah my nails match my coat um all right, bye guys. Okay, this is meant to be like a short or something. It's a nondescript box, so I'm not, I don't mind not showing it to you, but I ordered like $100 worth of jewelry bubble bar um bubble bar is where i got my charm bracelet last year and bubble bar um for target i buy a lot of my earrings from there they're having a seal so i got a couple of pieces oh wow really good at that. This is taking forever. Okay. I opened up the box upside down. That's fine. 